Hi everybody, in this tutorial we will learn about Adobe Director Environment or IDE. Adobe Director is a multimedia application authoring platform created by Macromedia, now part of Adobe Systems. Director is a multimedia development tool for creating interactive, cross-platform, multimedia presentations and animations. When we start Adobe Director, we are able to see a number of windows already open. In case a particular window is not open, then you can select the window menu to open a particular window. At the top, we have the menu bar containing options for performing different tasks. Next, we have the toolbar for performing commonly performed operations. In addition, we have a control bar that allows you to stop and play the animations and it allows you to see how your animation will look when it is finally produced. The projects that you create using Adobe Director are known as movies. All objects which appear in the movie such as text, images, graphics, video and audio are known as cast members. Let us now have a look at different windows present in this environment. Left hand side, we have a tools palette. It contains commonly used shapes for creating cast members. Stage window is the place where you can play the movie and see what it looks like in any moment of its creation. The cast window at the bottom is a library of all elements used in a director movie. That is, all elements used in the movie will have an entry in the cast window. For example, if we create a shape on the stage, then the entry for this object appears in the cast window. When a member is added in the stage, then it is called a sprite. The score is the place where you can actually direct the stage. The score is divided into frames. You can see the number of the frame above it. The movie you see on the stage is just a sequence of frames shown consecutively. There are different channels available in the score window. You can use these channels for creating different types of animations. On the right hand side, you can see the property window that allows you to view and set properties of any object in the director environment. For example, you may set the properties of any object that you want by selecting the options or the tabs that are available. For example, you can set the stage size by selecting the movie tab. The library window allows you to add predefined animations to the objects in a movie. This is all. Hope you all enjoy creating animations in Adobe.